San Diego. She sounds like she's so I lost my voice last night, guys. I like I haven't really gone out very much, and we had so much fun last night going out. Um, whenever I go out for like over two hours, though, I definitely lose my voice, so I'm struggling a little bit. I have a photo shoot in about two hours. Hopefully, I look a lot better by then because right now I'm not feeling too hot. Um, but Devin, where did we go last night? Okay, we started at the local, which maybe wasn't the vibe last night. Then we I thought it was fun. It's fun, but it's been more fun. I don't think I could have gone to the second place though, like without having gone somewhere like the first place. Right. Okay. I A guess. little too dive bar-y to like right to just be there. Go like, ahead and in. yeah. No, I agree. Yeah. And then we went to the Boys House, and then we went to the West End in North PV. It was fun though. I definitely like going out here a lot better than going out in LA. Um, the people are a lot more friendly. I always, no matter where, what city or like where I'm visiting, always have a better time when I'm visiting someone who lives there. Yeah. And just like knows what's going on and like. Yeah. You yeah. Know? So I like didn't even tell you guys like what we're doing or why we're here. So. We're in San Diego for the weekend, visiting Devin. Um, last night we went out, so today, like I said, I have a photo shoot. We're gonna hit the beach, go to a Padres game, and then tomorrow we're gonna hit brunch. So we have a really fun weekend planned. I like actually love it here. I like, whoa. I like knew that I was gonna like it here, but I really, really do. I'm excited to see it in the daylight though, because when we got here last night, it was dark out. So I'm excited to explore today. Obviously we'll bring you guys along. Try to call my grandpa guys, and he's not answering. <laughs> He's got things to do on his birthday. He left you on voicemail. What time is it there? 10? Maybe they're not up yet. What? Pops are always he up sleeps. He sleeps until like 11. Oh. Alright guys, what is up? Um, it's about 10.30. I am here with Kayton, we are about to shoot some photos. I will put his Instagram right here. Um, I've actually been wanting to shoot with him for a while since I moved to LA and I saw on his story two days ago trying to collab with different kinds of like models, photographers, brands and stuff like that. So I messaged him because I was coming to San Diego to set something up and we are at his friend's house right now. It's really pretty, the beach is right there. This dog is so cute, I'm in love. So yeah, here we go. Okay guys, we just went through pretty much all our inspo shots. Um, we got a little bit of everything. I'm so excited to see the photos. Honestly, like the very first few that we took, there was like close-ups of me like laying on a book and I really, really liked them. I really like his eye. So far, so good. Like everything that I've seen that he showed me, I'm very excited about. And we even did like some shower shots at the end, which I'm really excited about too. I'll put a couple of them here so you guys can see. Um, but yeah, I think we're wrapping up soon and I'm gonna head to the beach with Devin and Mackenzie and meet up with them again. So we only shot for like 30 minutes or so so just really fun little collab today and i will put his instagram handle right here again so you guys can give him a follow and yeah here we go we just got back from the beach not gonna lie to you i was terribly hungover and all i did was sleep but the beach was gorgeous we're gonna go back tomorrow so i'll show you some footage of that the shoe went good this morning my hangover like didn't really hit actually until like after the shoot thank gosh because i was not feeling good at all but we just got back um we're gonna hit the showers and then go get some tacos we were going to pasta go to a Padres game tonight but I think that we're gonna cross that idea off and go to the Sunset Cliffs but I've really been enjoying San Diego so far it's so much more my vibe I feel like than LA it reminds me like literally of the Jersey Shore mixed with Hawaii here it's hard to explain but I really really enjoy it all right guys just got ready tank top charcoal clothing pants are a fashion nova we're heading to get tacos I'm starving I'm feeling a lot better than I was earlier <laughs> I like literally couldn't move earlier on the beach or I think I would have thrown up so, aw, cute. It's the nicest she's been to me in days. All right guys, we went to Oscar's Mexican seafood. I got a fried shrimp taco and a fried fish taco, like battered. And I got the rice too, the rice looks really good. So we'll see how it tastes. They're good. They're huge. Yeah. 
Okay guys, we are at Sunset Cliffs. Um, the view is literally beautiful. We're here to watch the sunset. We were having kind of like a heart-to-heart -heart combo on the way here, just talking about trusting your gut and knowing what direction that you're going in and just trusting that whatever direction that you are going in is the right one for you. Because as you guys know, I'm like going home soon for a little bit, figuring out what I'm doing here. But yeah, you know, just know you're where you're supposed to be, I guess. All right, ladies. Right. <laughs> Whoa. Okay guys, we're headed for a night out. I'm just wearing this super casual outfit because like I didn't really think I was gonna make it out because of my hangover from yesterday. So I'm just keeping it really casual and simple. Um, like I said, tanked up from charcoal clothing, pants from Fashion Nova. The sunset's night at Sunset Cliff, the sunset's night at Sunset Cliffs. Why can't I say it? The sunset's night at Sunset Cliffs was amazing. Um, but yeah, here we go. I'm actually feeling a little bit better. Um, I'm just gonna keep it very light on the drinking tonight. I think that this summer I'm really gonna pull back <laughs> on drinking. I just like, I love going out and I love having fun with my friends, but uh, drinking just like really doesn't agree with me much anymore in the way where the next day I feel awful. I don't know why it's like ever since COVID, I just really haven't been like able to bounce back the way I used to. Maybe it's just getting older, I don't know. But yeah, so tonight, um, we might start out at the same place we started out at last night and we'll see how it goes. Good morning, San Diego. So it is our last day in San Diego. It is Sunday morning. Um, we went out again last night. I'm going to ask Devin, like, I'm going to write down a list of all the places we've gone and, like, how they were because I've been having so much fun here. It's so different than LA. It's, like, very much more college vibes, more laid back. Like, I wore Vans out last night and, like, I've never, I haven't been able to do that in a very long time. So it's been, like, very homey, very nice here. We're headed to breakfast right now. I have this romper on from Princess Polly and we're going to get some shots in i kind of lost my voice like every time i go out i swear i lose my voice a little bit but we're gonna go to breakfast and then i'll take you with us today obviously Okay, so this outfit I actually wore on our drive here, but I really like it, so I'm gonna try and shoot it. My hair right now is like something else. Like, I am like really trying to like figure out something for it, but I washed it before I came and I had it crimped, right? No, I didn't have it crimped, and then I crimped it the next morning. And then for my shoot, I had to get my hair wet, so I got wet, but I didn't like wash it. And then I went to the beach, so it's like really on another level. But we're going into this really cute shop right now. You've probably definitely seen it on Instagram before um, and hopefully we get some good picks. So cool, look at this. You want this palm tree in it? Like the scenery is unreal. San Diego is like I've never been a place that I feel like is more me in a town. Like I feel so at home here for real but I don't know if it's like a place I want to live. Maybe, I can't make any decisions, you guys know, but like, it's definitely high up there on the list of places I'm, I'm loving. So we attempted so many times to do this like photo of the three of us, like twirling, um, like dancing kind of, and hopefully we got one. Oh my gosh, if we didn't after that, I don't know what to say, but I'll put it right here. And I also in this dress, like um, if you saw my TikTok, this is one of the selects I got um, when I just went to a showroom last week in LA, and it's not something I normally would pick, but I absolutely loved it. So a little more frilly than what I'm used to, but um, I actually loved the shots I got, so I'll put them right here too. Views here are just so breathtaking. And this is the first time we've seen this many surfers. I'm so excited to watch them a little bit. Yeah. It hasn't rained in San Diego since like February. February. Yeah. Anyways, we are parting ways because Not this is Devin. <laughs> Devin has lunch plans. It's three o'clock. She has <laughs> lunch plans. 
And Sam and I are gonna go over to the beach, take a cute bikini photo. We've gotta do a little sunscreen thing. Yeah. <laughs> I like need food. Like a glass of wine. I know, I just Alright, let's ready to we rock and roll! Don't right. miss us too much, we'll be back soon! Well, thanks for having me, Seven. Done. Oh, okay. okay, so we just parted ways with Devin and Mackenzie and I are at the beach. We both are actually working with the same sunscreen brand. So we both have to do content for that brand and it's due tomorrow. So we figured while we're at the beach, we're going to shoot with that a little bit. So this is the sunscreen. I also did the self tanner for them a little bit ago. I sold that on my Instagram. Um, so I just took a photo up top in this like bathing suit and skirt. And then I'm going to do one like with this as we add to so. We'll see how that goes. It's like really cloudy today, but you still need sunscreen with the UV. It would be better if it was sunny, but it's due tomorrow. So we just gotta work with what we got. All right guys, that content was a little bit painful to shoot. Okay, now the sun's gonna come out. It's like just starting to get a little bit sunny. You know, it was a little sunny earlier. It wasn't right now at all. So we kind of started wrapping it up at the beach and we're gonna get dinner on the way out. I'm gonna drive home because Mackenzie drove here and she has a weekly wrap up to write. So I told her I would take the wheel. It's not that I have a weekly wrap up, it's that I have anxiety, guys. Yeah, she's a terrible driver, honestly. And I don't really mind driving. I'm not a terrible driver. She's like, okay, she's not terrible, but she's a timid driver. It I makes her anxious. Driving. So like, I don't really mind driving but I told her I will drive on one condition, which is that I'm not listening to her playlist. No Luke Bryan on the way home. Mackenzie listens to Luke Bryan more than like I've yeah. ever seen anyone. <laughs> Tell me your favorite Luke Bryan song. Mine is Kiss Tomorrow. Good night. All right, bye, San Diego. So we're gonna try and get food somewhere. The food here has honestly been really good, but obviously a little more expensive because. Loved it. You didn't like what? I haven't loved the food. Oh really? I thought my breakfast burrito this morning was really good. I my mean, tacos was pretty like, wow. good. Yeah, like I would say it's very beach town food. Look at my But I love that kind of stuff, like tacos and all. I like can't get this untied. Oh my god. I don't gosh. think that I can like put this on right now. No, you can't. What? Mackenzie's <laughs> tank top is so full of lint. Ew, <laughs> now you can't. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we just got pizza. It's um it's from the Square Pizza Company, actually. Um and we both got one slice, it was really good. We're gonna get ice cream before we head out. Oh my gosh. We're gonna get ice cream before we head out. Kind of sad to leave San Diego. I really, really liked it here. I don't know if it's somewhere I would want to be full time, but it gives me such Jersey Shore vibes. It's honestly making me excited to go back. But it's like almost Jersey Shore mixed with a more islandy <laughs> vibe. But it's like super, su all the people here are so cool and so chill. <laughs> So an hour and a half drive done. An hour and a half. Oh, two and a half hour and drive and half done. Oh my gosh, it like feels far when you're driving. Like two and a half hours isn't that bad, but it feels like yeah, it's how far. Yeah, was your drive? Would you have rather been sitting, you think? Kind of, like oh, I wish really? I was like sleeping and not driving, but it was okay. I mean, I didn't stay. there was no traffic, which was good. More home, bye. <laughs> Ew, what? All right, guys, we just got home from San Diego. Why should I was too rude? Like, it sounded like you moved in my ear. <laughs> We're home. I um, need to get out of this baby. This guys. Yeah, so please like and subscribe if you like this video. <laughs> Follow me on Instagram, please. My engagement has literally been so bad. It's like really making me upset. Um, love you guys. Bye. San Diego was a vibe. What was your favorite San Diego? Probably a lot. I don't know. Hi. See All right, you again. Bye.